For such a big history, this is a tiny land. The Palestinians are going through now for 40 years, a very harsh occupation that is aimed at uprooting them and replacing them and sending them to become new, uh, new refugees. It's horrific. It's just cheap land for religious people. The government sponsors it. They have a very good incentive to move here. And the people that suffer most are the people in the village. I mean, look how much, how much land they're losing. Wherever you have a settlement and you have people living beside the settlement, the settlers and ISIS inside the settlement, they get water and they drink water, they use water, while people outside the settlement, they cannot have access to water. Hello. The Bantu stands, for example, the, 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 the smallest, tiniest joke of a Bantu stand is bigger than the entire West Bank. And the West Bank is now uh, cut up into like 93 little areas. Uh, that uh, to move from one to the other you need to go through Israeli checkpoints and sometimes physical uh, obstacles. Hello. Where are the United Nations? Uh, now I have to, to support everything that the, the government decides. Where is the international where is the, where, where is the, uh, the international law? The record is quite clear. I mean, there's nothing that can be denied here. Hello, I am calling from Gaza. Hello. عندما أخذ من قوات الاحتلال إلى اعتقالي كان عمري 18 سنة وأنني أنحكمت خمسة سنوات على أشياء أنا لا أعرفها ولم. You're not told what are the charges, you're not told what are the evidence. Uh, you are the one who is uh, supposed to be the plaintiff challenging the administrative detention. The burden of proof is on you uh, to prove I don't know what. Hello.